Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Well, who else but Hazard? Uh, a slalom-like dribbler who's afforded a certain amount of freedom to stray where he wishes, and he's also a more consistent finisher and, and the sharpest of turners in the box. Yes, getting the best out of him will count for so much. So it's down to business here. De Bruyne. Now it's Lukaku. Uh, looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Witzel. Well, that's surely a foul free kick. He's had a go. It's anyone's ball. Decent ball. Now it's Lukaku. Good running with the ball. Can they build on it? Strong challenge, but well within the laws. Cheryshev. Cheryshev going full steam ahead down the left flank. Up to meet it! Hoists it forward. And it's Azar. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Hazard tried to play it through. Uh, was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. Goes long. Denier. Azar. Carrasco. There he goes, motoring forward. He'll have a go. Oh, fine stop from the keeper. De Bruyne simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. It's a busy front line, uh, lots of movement. And is that working for you? Well, not really. To be honest, I I'm not a great fan of taking goal potential away from the penalty box. De Bruyne. Cheryshev. That's a throw. And it's Cheryshev. Great leap! He's done well to get his head on that, but couldn't score. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Golovin. Witzel. De Bruyne. Still waiting for the first goal. Cheryshev. Not one to pass up the chance to run up the defence. He loves those duels. It opened up really nicely when the defence got all tentative then. Uh, they were cautious in making contact. Real chance! He can pounce on that. Marvellous goal! And grabbing that opening goal so close to half-time too affords them that extra little psychological edge 
And when it's one of your main men that's doing the damage, it just grows the togetherness and it grows the spirit. Carrasco was quick to move in. Keeper's handling wasn't great. That's just top-notch. Showed exactly why he follows it up every time. Keeper struggles to hold on to it. Ball breaks kindly. He's always about. So we have our breakthrough. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Finds himself eased off the ball. Played out to the right. Here's the ball in. And the first 45 minutes are up. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but one that still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. I'm sure they'll be very happy with their first half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain their momentum now and finish the job. Belgium head for the dressing room in possession of a 1-0 lead. And the second half gets on the way. Belgium going well here, and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Out of play for a throw. Golovin, and it's played forward, and that's left him on the seat of his pants. Ball's gone out of play. Mertens, it's a good run down the left-hand side. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter, we've seen at one of those raking passes just to spread the play. Still just a single goal between the sides. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Cut out in the nick of time. That's what has to be done now, no question about it. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Going for goal! It's a goal! And this is getting better and better. There was to be only one outcome. Yeah, and he knew all along what he wanted to do, and it's a really great instinctive finish. Things starting to look very comfortable. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. Ball swung in. Witzel. Witzel goes looking. De Bruyne. I have to say, that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks.
Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Tries to switch the play. He goes long. Cherishev collects the ball from behind. Up for the header! This could fall anywhere! Good run down the left. What can they make of it? He's in! De Bruyne! A real chance and a real let-off. Well, he did get himself into a good position. Something for him to cling to. So, time for changes on both sides, actually. Golovin. Belgium have time on their side now, as well as a two-goal lead. It is just about done. Looking for a decent ball in. A chance to play it in. And he's there to cut it out. Goes for goal! Oh, that was no routine save. Ziuba is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. They've played it short. Goes for the cross. Out to the left it goes. Cuts it out. Gets away from his opponent. Defenders on the back foot. Foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. Well, they're struggling to cope with a, a pacey dribble because they've not been at it as a team. I think the collective pressure needs to be better all around. Now it's cut. Oh, shooting chance! Decent strike, kept it fizzing low. Ferreira Carrasco just couldn't steer it on target. Everything else was, was up there. Golovin. And that's that. So they have their win. They had all the answers to whatever the opposition threw at them, and the result followed inevitably. Well, what are your thoughts on today's game then, Jim? Belgium have some very strong runners from midfield, and it's not often you'll see a team be so effective by advancing through the middle like that, but this was very impressive, the way they cut through the heart of that defence. Thanks to Jim alongside.